Hey guys, so in this video, I am going to walk you through how to set privacy settings on your recorded um, class meetings or videos that you made using Microsoft Teams. So any video that we create and record using Microsoft Teams is going to show up on the app called Stream. Um, so this is actually the service that emails you your recorded lecture after it's done processing. <clears throat> and there are different sets of privacy um, that you can set your video to. Um, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to log in to Office 365 on your computer. And if you haven't been to Stream before, you're probably not going to see it on your landing page on Office 365. But you can find it by searching in the search bar. Just type in Stream and the app will show up. Now what you'll notice is that there's always trending videos on the top and these are videos that are set to company-wide privacy. So meaning anybody within the company can um, click and watch these videos. Okay, so I'm going to pick on Dwayne a little bit because I know he won't mind. I'm going to click on his video. Now one thing you will notice is that at the bottom you see this little icon, this green icon, it said company. So that means Dwayne set the privacy of his video to company. So if you want to change that, what you're going to do is you're going to go to my content, videos, and you can see all of the videos that you have created. Um, now you notice mine, mine's colored orange. So it's only visible to people within the channel that I set access to. So to change that, um, or to check what your privacy settings are, I'm going to go to the pencil, to edit the video, <clears throat> okay. Sorry about that. And you can notice there's a lot of things you can do here. Um, the first thing I'm going to show you is here's your permission. So if you want it to be accessible to everyone in the company, you can set it to allow everyone to view the video. You can also go ahead and share it with specific groups, channels, or people. And then here is sort of where your permissions are, right? So you can deselect channels that you don't want it shared with um, or deselect people here or add um, groups or people that you want to share it with. Um, you can also find your embed code and your share links here. You can download your video directly to your hard drive or your computer. You can delete the video. You can change your video's name, add a description, as well as change the language for your closed captions. All right, um, so I hope this was helpful. Um, if you have any more questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to us. Thank you.